Why is my diet so off? We hear this a lot. First thing to remember is that a change in your eating habits for a prolonged period of time, either eating a lot more than you normally do or eating a lot less than you normally do, could be an indicator that you're heading towards burnout. But there are some things that you can do. And one of the things I want you to pay attention to is becoming a lot more mindful with your eating. We do so many things on autopilot, even our eating, that we don't pay attention to what we're consuming. And actually that means we're not processing the food. Our system isn't digesting the food as quickly or as well as it should. So mindful eating. That could mean once a week you sit by yourself and eat your meal on your own, paying attention to every single bite to the extent that you envision how that fruit or vegetable or whatever it is that you're eating, how it was actually produced, how it was grown. This gives you a deeper connection to the source of your food, but also will allow your body to process the food in the way that it needs to be processed. If you're someone that really enjoys cooking and preparing food, be mindful in that preparation. Be mindful in how you're preparing the food because the love that you put into the food that you're making will just absorb into your body a lot more. I know that sounds a little bit hippy dippy, but mindful eating is what I want you to pay attention to. And that will help you actually make better choices with the foods that you eat. So if you do notice that you're eating, your eating habits have been really poor, um, bring a bit of mindfulness into your eating and into the preparation. Let me know your biggest takeaway. And also, do you have questions? Questions about burnout, questions about well-being? If you do, let me know in the comments so that we can give you the information that we need, that you need. Um, I love giving you all this information. Until next time, be here and be, be well.